I'm not really wearing my snow jacket, which I actually brought with me, but I'm not wearing. And I don't really want to get soaked, so it's time to move. Moving on. Good morning guys. This is Tuesday morning. Last night we actually got our sleep so that was really good. We needed that bad because we didn't get hardly any sleep the first night. And man, it just downpoured last night. It didn't actually snow it doesn't look like. Not down here in the valley anyway. I'm sure it was like really close to the snow. I bet you the upper uh, cliffs around here are just covered with snow but man it got cold so it is really cool to at least take the chill off in here with a heater all right so here we go day number two of actually being able to do something so we've got to get some food get set up and then we'll head out and do something see you guys in a little bit we just found a looks like an old trail here right behind our campsite Got a little bridge here across the creek. It's kind of cool looking. I'm gonna go over and show Jennifer, mom, where the river sound is coming from. She hasn't seen it yet. Only Matt and I have on our way over to no, but we haven't gone this way yet. cruise on some trails. Not really sure if it snowed last night or not, but we're in Happy Isles here checking out this meadow area. I guess they call it a fen. Never heard of that before, but right now it's not raining, but it's snowing. It's actually snowing while we're out here hiking around in Yosemite. With it snowing and storming like this, it's been absolutely cool to be in a motorhome and have a shower because normally the way we get clean out here in Yosemite in the summertime is we have to go swimming in the river. Right now it would be a little cold to do that. So now we realize how cold it is. It's snow cold. And, um, but we're in the beautiful fen and it's starting to come down more. It's starting to come down more. <laughs> yeah, it is starting to come down more. And it's snowing. Just hiking around out here in Yosemite in the snow. Mom? It's actually a part of Happy Isles that I've never seen before always going on the big hike trails but we're just kind of exploring around here i'm not really sure what this little place is but got a little house thingy over there so i'm not really sure what this is oh there's a big rock fireplace over here too or fire pit all right, so now we're heading out to Happy Isles. We're gonna actually go out on the islands in between the Forks and the Merced River. Absolutely beautiful out here. God has just created some incredibly amazing scenery out here. Really thankful for this place. It's awesome. And here comes Matt and Mom. This is actually a field trip for Matt's homeschool as well. So he gets to read the signs and learn about things. Decaying plants and animals supply essential nutrients. Ponderosa pine kind of has a stubby little pine cone. We're talking about uh, animals, birds, trees, and uh, well, that's what we were talking about. What were your thoughts that you just had about all that? We're never going to get anywhere. <laughs> Our older son, John, would love this. He has a really high body temperature, 
And this is, I think this is the first time we've been to Yosemite that he hasn't been with us now that he's in college and everything. But he would love this. It's absolutely freezing out here. I think it's gonna start snowing again. But he has a really high body temperature. Yeah, it's snowing again. And he likes it cold. So he would probably love this. It is kind of cool though. All right, we just finished up in the nature center and coming outside and we've got another snow flurry going on. So now we're gonna head out to Happy Isles, I think, unless, I don't know. Hopefully this doesn't get any thicker. I think it's kind of fun. It is very cold, but it's just a little flurry and it's just something that you don't experience every day. April showers bring May flowers, so it's still part of the bringing some precipitation for uh, all the new growth around here. You know it's cold if Matt is asking for his jacket to be zipped up. Just a little while ago, he wanted it off. So we're gonna head on back to camp right now, I think, because it's getting really dark and it's coming down really good. And I don't see any breaks of blue in the sky anymore. It's just all dark. It's um, starting to snow pretty good. No longer a flurry. Well, maybe this is still a flurry, but um, I'm not really wearing my snow jacket, which I actually brought with me, but I'm not wearing and I don't really want to get soaked, so it's time to move. Moving on. It's terrible. We have to go back. I guess it's terrible because we have to go back. He doesn't want to go back. <laughs> Maybe snowing, but it's just amazing around here. You look at the buses, they're not full. The parking lots aren't full. The roads aren't full. The trails aren't full. There's just, this is cool. This is cool to be in here when there's not so many people. It's freezing out there, it's cold. You know, I know there's people that camp in the snow and all that kind of stuff, but you know, I kind of like camping in the summer where I can wear shorts and t-shirts and go swimming and stuff. But this is cool, this is totally cool seeing this on our trip. These birds out here seem to not, not really mind. It's cool to see the different things that God does with weather and nature and all that. Even though we came up to hike and bike, it's still fun. It's like a white Christmas just after Easter. It's actually very fun, very calming to look at the trees and see the snow fall, kind of like in Tahoe. So God's told us he wants us to film ourselves going out exploring his creation and film the adventure so we're getting a kind of an adventure here you know just kind of hang out 
in Yosemite with it snowing, out hiking when it's snowing. down here, Mom and Matt decided to play some cards, and I took a little nap. Unfortunately, my Is throat's feeling yeah. like it's getting a little sore, so hopefully I'm not going to get sick. That'd be a bummer, but it's kind of funny watching them. Matt's all goofy laughing and <laughs> building Mom's different piles of cards, yeah. trying to organize them. And he's Mom's messing Mom's Mom cards. up. Where are Mom's cards, Dad? <laughs> She's all serious and cards? wants to win, but... I'm not that serious. You're not? No. no she's not that serious. That's what she says. <laughs> <laughs> it's a game that never ends on and on, my friend. We had an hour game of Uno, and I took a win. Okay, this is the first time I decided to come up here and check out Matt's little loft. There he is. Is that him over there? Yeah. That's him that, over there. That's my idea. Let's make a... Uh, he's up here and kind of can look down over stuff. I'm going to make a floor. Come up here. I'm make a floor. But I also just noticed he's got a cool little spot up here. He's got a nice little view out this window. Check what? this out. I can see our creek and everything. So it's not a little, not too bad of a little spot up here he has. It's a little cramped, but plenty big enough for him. Plenty big enough to sleep. But yeah, it's pretty cool. You can see the creek and everything out here. That's pretty nice. Oh, could you turn it off, please? Not too bad. So I was pretty much thinking that today was an awesome day. Um, we didn't have any laundry that we needed to do. I woke up rested and warm. Uh, it was cold like outside the covers, but I had finally discovered how to dress myself at night so I wasn't freezing. I think it was an awesome day. Tomorrow I think we're going to try to pull out the bikes and do that. So we'll. Catch you guys again tomorrow. I'm gonna get cleaned up, get ready to go to sleep, get rested up, and explore some more of God's creation out here in Yosemite. Good night, you guys. God bless you, and see you tomorrow. So Jennifer kind of remembered to bring some smoothie. So I'm gonna drink some of that tonight, and hopefully, while we were standing out there at the fire, I started feeling my nose running and my throat kind of hurting a little bit. So hopefully a little bit of green smoothie will help me out. Pretty good. <laughs>